It's our last day and we're so sad. The last time I fished was with a Lego fishing pole and I didn't even catch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, we gotta go check out this cabin. That's pretty cool. See guys, life could be worse. It could be harder. Oh yeah, boy, in the belly. He's got a hook right there, you see that? So bear cubs, look, bear cubs. Are you serious? <laughs> We came to Costco and it is insane. Like this parking lot, there are no parking spots. It's crazy, you have to literally like sit and wait for someone to come out to find a spot or else there's so many cars in front of you. We had a spot, but this guy just didn't stop at the stop sign and went straight through and took it. So it's like a pack of wolves here. Hey, look, this guy is gonna leave faster I think than the old people. Because he only oh, has a thing of jerky. Hey, hey. So it's craziness. We'll see how it is inside. Okay, it took longer to find a parking spot here than it did to drive in California traffic. Yeah. That's insane. Okay. Neymar, ready to get out? I'm ready to get out. It's chaos in here too. What did he put on the paper for you? Oh. Tsunami! Look! Tsunami! What, what is, is it? it? I've been playing and stuff. Yeah. Happy and and oh treat. my goodness, and more treats! Hold up there and see if she eats it from you. She's been eating. See? She likes it. Oh, she has some up here too. She's a good horse, huh? Alright! You're gonna be blowing some water soon for ramen noodles. What are we looking for? Bowls. Open your eyes. Can you see it? No. Right, Savannah. Right there. No. Nope. It's a gullible. Mm, <laughs> out of a cup. Lizzie fell for it too. Look at the boys are falling for it too. Mm, it's a gullible, so and you all fell mm. for it. <laughs> okay, how are your ramen noodles? Really good. And yours as? Oh, that's a nice table. I like that. Okay, opening this up for healthy conversation in the comments. Healthy, healthy. And that is this, it's a statement that I've heard way too much. And I've even said it myself without thinking very clearly. But I just thought clearly, and I don't wanna be saying this statement unless I'm being sarcastic to someone, or, yeah, basically just sarcastic. Here it is, ready for it? This is the statement. Adulting sucks. Think about that. And here is the point of debate. Being a kid's awesome. I loved being a kid. I loved all the things that I experienced, some things I didn't love about it, about it. And hey, to this point, and even in time, I wouldn't give it back. But here is the debate. Here's the debate, the piece of the debate that I, my portion. And here it is, ready? <clears throat> there, in my mind, is incredible opportunity to enjoy life as an adult. Absolutely incredible. The problem is, if you still want to be a child, if you still want to be dependent on someone else or something else, and you want somebody else to take care of things for you, and you want to be lazy, and you want to be all of those things. Now, I know there's scenarios out there where becoming an adult changes things for some people. Becoming an adult uh, takes some things away. You know, you lose family members, uh, some, some sicknesses and some health things happen when you become an adult. That's obviously not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about agency and the right to choose to do what you want to do. I do not believe that adulting sucks. I think adulting is amazing. I think it is an amazing opportunity to become who you are through your actions, shoot through your decisions, and to push yourself to be the very best you can. There, it's yours, let's see how you feel about it. It better be good though, and be nice. Hey, Stubbs! Yo! Can I go fishing? Well, sure. Alright. Ugly? 
Hey, gig. Wait, are we gonna let go of the fi the let the fish go? When was the last time you fished? A uh, long time ago. What about the you, dog gig? that I the fish that I get that I catch if I catch a fish, then I'm gonna we're gonna bring it back and we're gonna eat it with yeah. the fish stick. Yeah, the fish, last fish time out of this lake has you eat them. Mm. The last time I fished was with a Lego fishing pole and I didn't even catch it. <laughs> <laughs> Some salmon eggs. How old are these eggs? <gasps> are you kidding me? Are they still soft? <laughs> soft and smelly. Here. This, by the way, this smell right here is what I smelled like when I was a kid. You ready for it? Mm -hmm. Okay, big whiff. I wanna smell it. I wanna smell oh. it. Oh. Smells like a seafood Ooh. restaurant. <laughs> no, let me smell that again. If you're, if that's you're, what that fish If your fingers like. didn't smell like that when you were a kid in my world, you weren't doing it right. Yeah, uh, you weren't cool. I would take a bottle of that and I would go up, up and down the river, up Payson Canyon, and I'd come back with 15, 20 fish. <laughs> okay, my hands smell like nasty fish eggs, salmon eggs. I'm getting eaten alive by mosquitoes. Like they are chewing me up, but I am in absolute heaven right now. This is incredible. Fishing with the kids, nice and cool temperatures, the lake, Fishing. the trees, the fresh air. Oh, I just am in absolute heaven right now. Loving this. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. That was a pretty good one. Okay, start reeling. Start reeling before it, so it doesn't hit the bottom. That was really good for your first cast in a long, long time. So far, no fish. A couple neighbor guys came by and said that they had uh, caught some easily on spoons and I've tried that and it didn't work so far. So I have three poles in the water, no fish yet. And we've already lost Gigo, Lizzie, and Az to throwing rocks. And we gotta go check out this cabin. That's pretty cool. He's a good swimmer. Good. Oh, nice. Oh, oh pretty good. This is open right up, isn't it? Animals living in this thing for sure. <laughs> oh, wow, this ain't bad. No, the sheet rock and everything in it. Wouldn't take much to fix this old thing up. No, shoot. You it's got, got power up here. What else is in here? A bed? A couple beds. See guys, life could be worse. It could be harder. I mean, look at the view out the window. It's got a plaque up here. It says, in memory of a life so beautiful lived and a heart so deeply loved. Okay, so we explored enough of this lake and didn't get one bite, so we know that there's another lake below that we passed on the way up, so we're gonna go take a, take a look at that. Are you driving the fire truck? No way, dude. Woo you got pizza? You got hiccups. The pizza? You got pizza and this little green dude? Cause Noni can't say no to you, huh? The train is here! Yay, we're gonna get on the train! This is the best train! This is the best train! We made it! <laughs> Spotted baby, look at that. And then mama has a collar on. She's being followed. You are being studied. Hey, that was a good cast actually. Wow. It was bobbing. It was bobbing. It was gone, yeah. He may have got off with the stuff. They got our bait. Oh. 
Where's oh the boy, yeah, in the belly. Oh dang. Yep. Pull it. I was like, is that a hair? And then I like. He's got a hook right there. You see that? Oh dang. Got it. Oh sweet. It's a fly. Okay, no fish, but we had a great time. We did. That was yeah. so fun. <laughs> it was fun. It was good. Two bites, right? Two bites. Two bites. No fish. No but bites. A whole bunch of fun. Well, not real. Time to go eat dinner. Make dinner. So bear cubs. Look, bear cubs. Climbing the tree. Are you serious? Where's mom? That's amazing. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. Okay, the, we don't know where mom is right now. There's the cubs, but we're safe in the truck. But where is mom? What do you guys think about that? That's so cool. There's where the fire was the other day. Look at the sunset, Savannah. It is amazing. It's time to cook the most random selection of food ever. So we're having fish and chips. I don't want fish and chips. So I'm having eggs and toast. And Lizzie wants bacon too. So right now I'm cooking some fries up. Time to collect some eggs. Ooh, you gotta give us some eggs. There's some, what's flying around in here? Oh, wow. Thank you, thank I you. I think that's all 10 of them. What is in here? What's flying around? I'll grab three, you grab three. We'll be happy, happy. It's our last day. We're so excited to see Branson and Johnny and Savannah and Lizzie and Azen Canyon. And we're so sad about this. Yeah, we're sad that always when we have to leave Disneyland, we have to leave Allie. Mm -hmm. And especially it makes it more sad that we've got to spend so many days with you. I know. That's okay. You'll be back soon. We will be back soon. Okay, I feel horrible right now. I told the kids we're going to have ice cream. Sarah called me. We ended up on the phone for like two hours. And the kids waited for me. They waited for me to have ice cream. Like, I feel so horrible right now. They waited for me to have ice cream and they didn't ice cream, get ice cream. But the Canyon and Ab, I just told them goodnight and they said, ice cream? Do you guys want ice cream still? Yes. We're doing it. We're eating ice cream at 2.30 and I'm gonna go ask the girls if they want it. If they don't, that's okay, but I wanna at least invite them. Girls. The boys just told me that we didn't, that they didn't eat ice cream. You were waiting for me? Yeah, they didn't wanna eat without you. I'm sorry, so okay. the boys are actually they still want ice cream, so we're having ice cream. You want ice cream? Sure. Let's do it. 2.30 in the morning. I'm like, I feel so horrible. At the same time, I'm so glad, happy that, man, I, we have the most amazing kids ever. This bird wants to get inside. It was first on our deck and now it's on the window of the cabin. Kitty, don't get it. Phoenix. I wonder if it needs help. Mm-hmm. No. <laughs> <laughs> I caught a bird. <laughs> you caught a bird. With my left hand. Huh. Did you hear it squeaking? Yeah. Oh well. It's a cute little bird. Look at this guy. Found a praying mantis. Look at that guy's shirt. so cool. Well, I gotta let the bird go. Look at that cute little thing. Here we go. Fly away, birdie. Fly away. Go, go, go. Oh, don't go up there. Oh, dang it, I knew that was gonna happen. It went up to the light. You up there, birdie? Well, I believe if I turn off the light that it will fly away. Actually, I think that's where it came from originally is I scared it off of there and then it flew into the window. It's alive though and we're doing well. And good night, Bertie. All right, guys. Thanks for joining us today. Your value is not about what other people think of you. Your value is not the way people treat you. 
people treat us all in different ways and they might be having a bad day so they treat us bad that doesn't mean that we're horrible so we gotta be careful not to think of ourselves through other people's eyes we have so much value you have so much value you are you and if you're concerned and worried about what other people think of you it's time it's time to start loving yourself more caring for yourself taking care of yourself speaking nice to yourself it's time start picking yourself up and making stuff happen because there's no one else that's going to do it for you anyway we love you guys never forget that you are worth it <laughs>